Welcome to our place, we've been waiting. Time for some fun and celebrating. Something is always ready to pop. Here at the Naughty Shop. Music and magic, hey, it's showtime. Naughty and you will be friends in no time. Silly old goblins are living there too. The place where make-believe comes true. Believe it or not, here at the Naughty Shop. Amour. Amour. is for her to stop singing. And I have to look at all my Valentine's Day cards. Oh, Valentine's, how lovely. I even got one from a secret admirer. <gasps> yeah, yeah. Secret admirer will be do. A secret admirer? How exciting! Oh, to be a child again, to be stung by Cupid's tiny arrow. <laughs> Cupid? What's a Cupid? He's a little guy that flies around and shoots you with an arrow. Then you're supposed to fall in love. <laughs> really? An arrow? So you really like that card, huh? I love it, but it's driving me crazy. I have to figure out who sent it to me. How come it's a secret? Well, Truman, some boy sent Kate a card, but he doesn't want her to know that he sent it. <laughs> Why, it could be anyone. What about you, DJ? Where are your Valentine's Day cards? I, uh, I left them at school. Hello, everyone. I brought some sweets for you today. Oh, Miss Hilda, let me uh, help you with these. That, that was very sweet of you to think of us on Valentine's Day. <laughs> well, they don't call me Hilda Sweetly for nothing. <laughs> Are you going to the dance contest? Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> Why not? A lovely lady like yourself, you should be out there swirling around the dance floor. <laughs> well, I, I have no one to swirl with. <laughs> Amour, amour. Uh, well, why don't we all go outside and finish these off before they melt? Oh, good idea. <laughs> I'll put all those Valentines in the mailbox there, sure. Okay. Great. <laughs> Nobody's going to send me a Valentine's Day card. And if I'm not getting any, why should they? <laughs> This'll be a Valentine's Day they'll never forget. <laughs> uh -oh. Now what? This is a Valentine's Day card. You should send one to each other. Here, let's go. Okay. No, 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 this is Kate's card. You can't take that. You have to make one of your own. Oh, a dog? A dog? What, do you the pencil? Oh, yeah. You look at this card. Oh, the pencil. Oh, my God. Pencil. 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 Dad, be careful. <laughs> wow. Maybe we better do something else for Valentine's Day. Dad, come on. I'm gonna get a pencil. Have you figured out who your secret admirer is yet? No, not yet. But I made a list of names. Maybe it's Pug Porgy. Pug Porgy? I don't think so. Mm, you're right. Pug already gave me a card. 
What if it's Herman Dimplemeyer? Herman Dimplemeyer? He doesn't even know how to spell. Teak Zool. Teak Zool, no way. Hmm. Then it's from... It's from Grit. Grit? Get out of here. I can't believe you think Grit sent you a Valentine's Day card. Well, if you're so smart, maybe you could tell me who it's from. Uh, can we talk about something else for a change? Hey, can you tell me a naughty story? About Valentine's Day. No, make it about something else. Okay, then. We'll make it about a dance contest, like the one Aunt Agatha's going to. Okay, make it about a dance contest. Is Naughty going to be on the dance contest? Yes, but he didn't know it yet. Why not? Well, first of all, he couldn't dance. And second of all, he had a secret admirer. Mm. Okay, let's pretend. It was a sleepy evening in Toyland, and Naughty and Big Ears were drinking lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> really? That's a mighty strange noise. I know, Big Ears. Uh, I'm sucking the last drops of lemonade out of my glass. Oh. Now that is a mighty, mighty strange noise. It's Mr. and Mrs. Tubby Bear. I hope they haven't come down with something. What are you doing? Oh, uh, ha, <laughs> ha. Uh, uh, good evening, Naughty. Uh, uh, the missus and I are, uh, oh. uh, well, uh, we're waltzing. Waltzing? Is this waltzing a sort of wrestling? Uh, bless you, <laughs> no, Naughty. It's dancing. We're practicing. For the Toy Town Dancing Competition. Oh, that takes me back. Please continue. Rhino, my dear. Ready. After three. With a one, two, three. La, 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 oh, la, 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 oh, dear. La, la, oh, dear. La, la, Yo, you're la, stepping la, all la, over la, me. La, la, oh, my la, gracious. La, la, oh, la, oh, boy. La, la, Dancing looks really la, hard. La, la. Have you heard the news? There's going to be a Toy Town dancing competition. You bet, Tessie Bear. We've just heard the news. Naughty, I'd like you to be my partner in the dancing competition. Well, but I can't dance. I've never danced in my entire life. It's easy. I could teach you how to dance. Really? Would you, Big Ears? Certainly. I was quite an expert in my younger days. I'd be happy to teach both of you how to dance, <gasps> uh, starting tomorrow. Oh, come on, Naughty. Well, all right, Tessie, I'll try. I have to pick Miss Pink Cat up from the station in the morning, but we can start as soon as I've taken her home. Please hurry, Naughty. I've got to get home quickly. I simply must have my tail fluff for the dancing competition. I'm entering the competition, too, with Tessie Bear. Oh, poor, poor Naughty. You all won't stand a chance of winning. Not against me and my partner, Mr. Sparks. Let's see now. Um... <clears throat> Stop! Stop! Oh! 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 Ah! Oh! Oh! See, golly. he's such oh. a fine mover. <laughs> I hope he doesn't move like that on the dance floor. <laughs> oh! When he dances, oh, Mr. Sparks oh. is a beautiful oh. mover. And left and right and left and right and oh, that's good, Noddy. You see, you are a dancer. Thanks a lot, Big Ears. You're a good teacher. Keep practicing. <laughs> Remember, Noddy, practice whenever you have the chance. Gosh, Dinah, you and Mr. Jumbo are pretty good dancers. Well, Mr. Jumbo is a very, oh, oh a, a, a very lively dancer. Oh. I have to practice my dancing. I'll pretend you're Tessie Bear. Oh, be careful, Naughty. Oh. That's an antique jug. I'm sorry, Dinah. Oh. I'll practice somewhere else. Mr. Jumbo, kindly put me down. Oh, so sorry. So, they're having a dancing competition, are they? Should we enter? Of course not. 
goblins don't answer competitions lie. We ruin them for everybody else. Oh. <laughs> My lords, Ooh. ladies, gentlemen, and toys, gather round. It is my pleasure to announce the Toyland Dancing Competition. Open! Will couple number one please take to the floor? Mr. Wobbly Man? Oh. This tune starts out very quietly, Mr. Wobbly Man. I'm afraid I don't hear any music playing, Mr. Plod. What? Why not? <laughs> Whoa! This record player has nothing inside, you know. Nothing at all. Someone has stolen the workings of the competition record player. Oh. This means the competition cannot take place. Oh. Mr. Plod, Mr. Plod, Big Ears has a record player. Yes, I do. But it's a mighty old one. Maybe Noddy could take me in his car to get it. Of course. Off you go, then, as quickly as you can. Meanwhile, perhaps Clockwork Clown will keep us happy with some of his tricks. Clowns always keep people happy. Twat, Big Ears ruined our plans to ruin the competition. What'll we do now, Gobbo? I'll think of something really mean. <laughs> Drive as fast as you can, Noddy. Right, Big Ears. Whoa, no, <laughs> Noddy. Drive almost as quickly as you can. Tessie Bear likes Naughty. Tessie Bear likes Naughty. You're right. Tessie Bear is Naughty's secret admirer. Just like Grit is my secret admirer. Grit is not your secret admirer. How do you know? Never mind. I just wish everyone would stop talking about Valentine's Day. It's a lot of mushy junk. Uh, DJ, what's your problem? <laughs> we sent Valentine's cards to all our friends, but... We didn't get any. Uh, how come, Sherman? How come? P Pluto, they sent cards to all their friends, but I didn't get one. Mm, I guess I'm not their friend. We, we didn't, didn't get, get any Valentines? Tsk, tsk. Everybody's so unhappy. This isn't the way Valentine's Day is supposed to be. But that's the way it's going to be, Granny. Because if I can't get a Valentine's Day card, they can't get a Valentine's Day card. <laughs> I've got them all, and I'm not going to give them back. <laughs> OK, Dad, go ahead. Give Mom your Valentine's Day gift. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> no! No, Mom, you're supposed to put them in water! I No! It's good! Forget it. Just give Dad your Valentine's Day gift. Oh, yeah. Candy. Isn't that nice? What do you do now, Dad? Oh, yeah, but it's open. to tell me the rest of the naughty story? Just as soon as I finish this Valentine's Day card for Grit. There. Done. So who won the dance contest? Was it Miss Pink Cat? You never know. There might be a surprise ending. In fact, there are a lot of surprises on the night on the dance contest for everybody. Keep flipping clockwork clown. They can't be long now. <laughs> Here's the record player, Mr. Plod. Oh, what a relief. Well done, Clockwork Clown. Are the judges ready? Ready, uh, yeah, Mr. Plod. Ready, so gonna... Then take your partners for the Toy Town Dancing Competition. <laughs> oh, you're doing so much better, dear. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're not stepping on my feet at all. Uh, no, of course not. Ah. Very <laughs> and oh, right oh, Mr. Sparks, you right are not right such a beautiful mover after all. Let's go, Sparks. Yes. Oh. Nah. Whoa. Uh, oh, oh, dear. I am 
proud to dance with such a beautiful lady. Let's cut a rug. <laughs> You're a wonderful dancer, Tessie. This is going so well. Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh. Sorry. Sorry about that, everyone. <laughs> Sly and Gobbo. What are you two goblins doing? We We'd like to win this beautiful trophy. Well, my lad, if you want to win the trophy, <laughs> you'll have to dance for it. Uh, of course. Come on, Sly. Oh, here we go. Uh, oh! Oh, that that was was that was good. Good. Tell us, who are the champion dancers of Toyland? We would like to award a special prize for the most unusual dance to the goblins Sly and Gobbo. Oh. Oh. But the winners of the Toyland Trophy for the best dancers in the contest are Tessie Bear and Noddy. Oh. I like dancing, Tessie. So do I. I could dance all night long. So could I. I'm glad Naughty and Tessie won. So am I. Oh, look, it's Grit. Now I can give him his Valentine's Day card. That'll be 25 cents, Grit. Thank you. Oh, hi, Grit. Hi. I liked your card. What card? My Valentine's Day card. You don't have to pretend anymore. I know you're my secret admirer. I don't know what you're talking about. The only thing I like on Valentine's Day is candy. You mean you didn't give this card to me? I never saw it before. You're crazy. I'm getting out of here. That isn't funny. You having a little trouble trying to figure out who your secret admirer is, Kate? Well, sort of. I don't want to talk about it, Grandpa. You don't have to talk to me about it, but... You might want to read this book. You might find a few clues in there. The Princess and the Frog. Mm-hmm. There once was a princess, lovely and fair, who went for a walk in the afternoon air. And who do you think that she met? A frog who was slimy and wet. The frog seemed your everyday run of the pond, but this one had talents that went far beyond. And to her amazement he spoke. Yes, these were the words he did croak. Have you kissed a frog today? Come on, lady, don't delay. Be first on your block to say, I kissed a frog today. I kissed a singing frog today. The frog shocked the princess, but did not offend. She said, I won't kiss you, but we can be friends. To the palace this frog I will bring. Tonight we shall dine with the king. The king grew impatient. It's all quite absurd. It's late and this frog hasn't uttered a word. Just then the frog cleared his throat. He started to sing and I quote. Have you kissed a frog today? Come on, lady, don't delay. Be first on your block to say, I kissed a frog today. And the princess grew closer with time She thought little froggy was funny and fine But who could have forecasted this? The day that she gave him a kiss When the smoke finally cleared she was clearly convinced The little wet frog had turned into a prince Happily together they live And here's the advice that they give Things may not be what they 
seen. That includes a frog that's green. Look inside and you may say, I'm glad I kissed a frog today. I kissed a singing frog too. Excuse me, I think I've got a frog in my throat. <laughs> Grandpa, are you suggesting that my secret admirer is a frog? No, no, I'm not, Kate. But I think it's true that things aren't always what they seem. And people aren't always what they seem like either. Sometimes the people that we know best are the ones who really surprise us, especially if they're trying to keep a secret. You think DJ's my secret admirer? Ah, well, I got a feeling. It's just a hunch. But, uh... I think he's a little shy about telling you. What's the matter, Kate? Oh, I feel awful, Grandpa. I didn't even give him a card. No wonder he's been acting so weird. Mm. <laughs> I never knew that Valentine's Day could be so much fun. <laughs> Everybody thinks they sent cards out but nobody got any. <laughs> See, there's one for Granny, one for Bonita, and there's one for Warlow, and there's one for... Warlow? <gasps> Warlowworth Q. Weasel. That's me. I got a Valentine's Day card. <laughs> I wonder if there's more for me. Planet Pop, Bonita Flamingo, There's another one for me. This is so nice. It's terrible. Oh, what am I gonna do? He'll be sorry. He'll be sorry now. What's this? What does it say? It says to DJ. Then I guess it's for you. Open it. It's a Valentine's Day card from you. I finally figured out that you are my secret admirer, and that's why your feelings were hurt. I didn't even give you a card. That's all right. I mean, Valentine's Day is really for girls anyway. No, it's not. It's for friends. Best friends, right? Right. Uh... Tragedy has struck. Oh, woe is me. What's the matter now, Agatha? Oh, I was just passing by, and I wanted to wish you all the best tonight at the Valentine's dance. Well, save it, Hilda. We're not going. Mr. Flugelschmidt has the sniffles. The sniffles? Oh, now that is too bad. Does that mean you're not going to go? Well, what's the point? I can't dance with myself. You could go with Hilda. She doesn't have anyone to dance with. Well, that's very thoughtful of you, Truman, but I doubt that Hilda would want to dance with me. No, I mean, Hilda should go with Grandpa, and you can stay here and babysit. What? Go with me? Truman? <laughs> well, I'd love to. Really, Hilda? You'd like that? Well, I love dancing, Noah. I just wish I had something else to wear, but... Oh, what are you worried about that for? Here, Hilda, Ooh. wear this. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. now, doesn't that look nice? Oh, my. Did anybody ask if I mind missing the dance and taking care of the children? No, nobody. But that's all right. I insist. You could use a little more amour, Noah, if you know what I mean. <laughs> mm. Well, what are you two doing standing there? Go get ready for the dance. Come on. I'll oh, help you with your cart. Oh, amour. Oh. Um, <laughs> well, aren't you just a little matchmaker? Just like Cupid. Yes! What are those goblins up to now? Mom? Where's Dad? No! <laughs> Gee, Dad, what are you doing dressed like Cupid? You don't have to make me happy on Valentine's Day. You have to show Mom how much you love her. Snipe? <gasps> oh, 
Oh, good night. All I wanted was for you to act like normal parents just once for Valentine's Day. But I know you really love each other. Yeah. And hey, we're not normal. We're goblins, right? Goblins are good and normal. Oh, the goblin. I love you too. Hey, I know what we can do. Let's go for a walk. I thought you cared about me, but you didn't even give me a Valentine's Day card. Uh, Sherman, I thought you were my best friend. I am. That's why I thought you, of all clowns, would send me a valentine. But I did, Sherman, I did. Then where is it? Hmm? Wow! <laughs> we want a valentine's! So sad, so sad. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. <laughs> Orlo Worth Q Weasel, what are you doing? Well, I uh, found all these Valentine's cards in the mailbox, so I'm delivering them. Found them? Why, you... Now, Sherman, remember it's Valentine's Day. Oh. Thank you for delivering our Valentine's cards, Warlo. There may even be some for me. Oh. I'm sure there are. Oh, yeah. I think there's one yeah. there. That... Hey, 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 Johnny C again, and have I got a Valentine's Day joke for you. <laughs> You're gonna love it! Uh, okay, here goes. Knock, knock! Who's there? Olive. Olive who? I love you! <laughs> Get it? <laughs> I love you! Oh, Valentine's what a day! Mm -hmm. oh. La da dee da dee da la dee. You'll never guess who won the dancing contest. Who? Rap and Hilda Sweet. Oh, isn't that wonderful? But where are they? They're outside. They had so much fun. They wanted to keep on dancing. Oh, let's go look outside. Truman, so do I. To learn more about Naughty, visit PBS online at www.pbs.org. Mm -hmm.